Hey there guys and welcome to what is quite an outdated unboxing but today I am unboxing a PlayStation 2 2.4 GHz wireless gamepad uh, from Crown. Uh, so it's not an official one because Sony don't make them and it's compatible with all PS2 games and consoles it's got an ergonomic design, it's got great vibration feedback and uh, it is really quite similar to the actual controller uh, there are a few minor differences though so I'll just go over those as we get into more detail so uh, I'm just going to pull it out, give us a second so here you go, I've just pulled it out of the box and uh, as you can see already, there's sort of patterned uh, shapes instead of uh, just normal shapes. They're sort of in patterns. So on the back first, we have a little bit of uh, legal. And uh, the shapes are a uh, pattern. Uh, um, my camera really needs to focus. But uh, yeah, here you go. So the pattern shapes instead of the normal uh, shapes and the select and start buttons are exactly the same uh, there's a power LED and the mode LED on the back uh, and uh, it's also uh, quite a decent controller it feels a lot like the original thing and I've actually used it for quite a bit now um, and it's very good and there's no lag whatsoever which you would expect but uh, as it says on the actual product page on Amazon uh, it promises no lag because it's 2.4 gigahertz uh, there's also uh, this which is what you plug into the PlayStation 2 it's very simple to set up you plug that in you turn on the switch on the bottom of the controller and uh, there you have it so uh, here is uh, an actual Sony controller and so just to show you the differences the game uh, the pattern is there the PlayStation and Sony logos are not there uh, but it's really really very very similar so there you go those two together also, it's important to note that on the bottom of this controller is an on-switch. Uh, a tip I can give you guys, always switch this on, and it will go to sleep after a bit anyway, so you really don't ever need to switch it off. And I haven't switched it on since that day, and I filmed this quite a while ago. So, uh, yeah. Uh, and that's it, really. And also remember to put batteries in, it does need two batteries, I recommend these Energizer Ultimate Lithiums, uh, pop off the back uh, using the standard kind of uh, features and just put them in. But uh, what I was getting to is uh, to set up, you plug it in the back of the PlayStation, uh, you, you have the controller switched on, then you switch the PlayStation on, then it works better and it gets all set up. So. There you have it, the Crown 2.4 GHz wireless controller. So guys, remember to rate, comment and subscribe. Check out the offer in the description and I'll see you next time.